Hi, I'm Jeff Poole at the ICAR Tech Center in Appleton, Wisconsin. Welding is an important part of many collision repairs, and if you're welding, you should be performing test welds and doing destructive testing. We're going to look at a simple tool here today that is designed for helping us with peel tests. So our peel test tool is made out of some one-inch plumbing pipe, and that's the larger piece that we take and we peel the coupon with, and that's just got a slot cut in it with a cutoff wheel. This is one inch plumbing pipe, it's about six to eight inches long, whatever is going to work for you. And then our handle up here is made out of half inch plumbing pipe, about 18 to 24 inches, whatever you want so far as leverage goes. And then we just, uh, in this case, we MIG braced them together right here. And it works out really well, gives us plenty of leverage. And it's about the right diameter here that when we're rolling the coupons, uh, we can take and we get those to peel apart really nicely. And uh, again, very simple, economical, quick to make, and comes in handy for both testing the MIG brazes and if you're doing uh, resistance welds, more than one. Typically with resistance welds, uh, we'll take and we'll do a twist test if it's only one weld. But if you're doing, if you're testing, say you do two or three welds and you want to test the performance of that, you're going to have to then peel those apart. So this will work out for that as well. Whenever you're preparing for practice MIG braze or other destructive test welds, in situations where you're going to do a peel test, you want to make sure that you've got your coupons oriented properly to each other. It's helpful to take and bend the thicker of the two coupons, if you've got a thicker coupon, uh, at a 90 degree angle before you actually weld the samples together. This gives you something to place in the vise whenever you go to do your destructive test that you can then peel the other coupon off of that coupon. So essentially we've got the coupons clamped together, the back coupons already bent at a 90 degree angle, that makes it easier for us to do our destructive test. We'll position in the vise near the end of the jaws of the vise. This allows us to take our peel tool and use the slot right here to engage the top coupon. And then we can take and start to peel it off. I realize that I do need to take and turn the uh, amperage down just a little bit and then reperform this and see if I can get a better result. We get the tool to come in and engage the coupon. Then we can peel it off. So this one's looking a little better than the last one, but it's still not looking real great. I've got some more uh, practice to do. I'll do some more test MIG braises, get things tuned up a little bit better before I weld on the vehicle.